I'm Kim Hussey, and we're going to do something really, really fun today, and that is compare sounds of ukuleles based on the fact that each of these ukuleles, we've got three of them, uh, have different wood combinations. Uh, one of these ukuleles is, uh, uh, is a Cuban mahogany, uh, the other is koa, and the third is a Brazilian rosewood. So what we're going to do is play the same song on each of these ukes to give you opportunity uh, to, uh, to form an opinion about different sounds. So the first one I'd like to play for you is this ukulele. And what I'm going to do is play the same song uh, in each of these ukuleles so, you have a, uh, so you're able to make a very, very good comparison. Here we go. And the next, Koa and Spruce. Redwood, Brazilian Rosewood. Okay, uh, in comparing the sound of these three ukes, I must say that the winner is all three of them, uh, because it would be wonderful if I could take all three of them home. However, uh, uh, let me describe at least uh, uh, to you what I think are the differences in sound. And these sound have, has nothing to do with good or bad. They all have to do with quality of the sound. First of all, the rosewood, uh, I thought, had a very powerful sound 
because that sound was so powerful, it permitted me to, to, to use and exercise a very, very good dynamic range as I played the song. Uh, the, the koa, uh, I would describe as if, if, if we had a spectrum uh, between very powerful on one end and on the other was really a nice lilting sound, I would say that the koa was right in between. The Cuban mahogany was closer to the very light uh, sound as opposed to a powerful sound. So the Cuban mahogany, I think, is a uke that you play early in the morning or you play uh, all by yourself because it has a very, very reflective yet beautiful sound.